When Jason came back to poor Charles, he called himself Jake Doe. He had no memory of his past, but Nicholas knew because Helena told him, and then he told me. And not only did I choose to keep that secret, I made Nicholas promise not to tell anyone. Now it seems inconceivable that I would do that. But I felt like I had lost so much with, with Jake and Lucky, and so I, I clung to Jason like a life raft. I convinced myself that keeping the secret was the right thing to do. I was gonna marry Jason knowing he was married to Sam. I will always regret that decision. You mean you were hurting? You made a mistake, you can't blame yourself forever. You may be the real reason you were able to keep it a secret. It's because deep down, you knew he wasn't me. When Nicholas told me Jake Doe was Jason, I believed him. I still believe it. The DNA test proves it. Then how do you explain me? How do you explain the things that I know, the things we just talked about? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to think. I just know that I came here to tell you what I know, and that's it. Okay. Thank you for telling me about the twin. At least I have a place to start looking. I will talk to Franco about getting you out of here. Maybe you're home and you're in bed and you're asleep and that's why you're not answering the phone. I hope that's why. I'll be there soon. Yeah. Hope everything's okay. Elizabeth learns the truth, and Elizabeth will be learning that I was a monster even back then. And then everything that I've done since then, all of the torturing people, all of the persecuting people, all of the ghoulish and disturbing art, that wasn't a byproduct of a tumor. That was my actual DNA. Yeah. That's not gonna happen. Not now. Not yet, anyway.